Hello everybody and welcome back to another episode of Let's Play with Clay and this time we're doing potion making! Yay! We'll be doing other things too but mostly potion making and collecting resources because I really want to make mining go a little bit faster and I also want to upgrade our sword so that we can try to get maybe looting three on it and make it better than what it is right now because I'd like to speed up the whole skull collection process because we're now at episode 33 and yeah so at some point in this episode um I'm gonna remind I'm going to remember I'm not gonna remind myself I'm going to remember to throw out diamonds because I forgot to do that at the end of the last episode which is very bad of me so yeah and um it's been a long time coming, getting back into this series. I... <sighs> it's a long story, and I'm gonna do a vlog about it. Well, I did a vlog about it, so... I'll, I'll just, um... Yeah, I'll link that vlog in the description so that you can listen to the story about what's going on. But basically, it, it was a problem with a lot of things, so... Yeah, I just, I want the potions of regen because I really need regen when I'm fighting the weather. That's what I've learned, that golden apples, regen, and really good weaponry seem to be the best to fight the weather, which is pretty much every resource known to man. And there's not really much strategy in that. It's just me hitting the wither really hard and making sure that the wither can't kill me. Which, I, I guess it's a good strategy. I mean, it's... It is what it is. So, yeah, um, I, I want to have a lot of regen. I want regen for the rest of the universe, because you can't have happy universe unless you have six minutes of regen. I just don't know if you can combine potions. Let me know in the comments if you can actually combine potions. Like, if you combine three two-minute potions, does that give you six minutes of regeneration, or are you just wasting potions? So, yeah, um, really need to... I. I've thought about it, but I really don't want to combine those two. Like, I was thinking for a second, yeah, I want to do that, but I, I really don't. Um, I do need to make a lot of repairs, though. Because that's kind of important, and I apologize for a little bit of sniffliness here and there. I was considering not recording tonight, only because I was sniffly, and I don't like the sound of myself being sniffly. But it was necessary. That's a lot of levels. Um... Oh my god. Well then. Uh, we're going mining. And I think I'm going to take the opportunity, being as I have the diamonds here, and I, if I remember right, I was withered eight times in the last episode. Was it eight times? I don't remember. I really don't remember, and I feel bad that I don't remember. Um. But, let me go back in here, because I have something on my mind, and I can't really put it into words. Um. Yeah, see, there... There's at least one episode where I have forgotten to throw out diamonds, so yeah, that's what I was trying to say. It just wouldn't come out of my mouth. I'm sorry. <laughs> anyway, so yeah, let's um do this right. Not that we can really afford to throw away diamonds, because I, I don't like to throw away diamonds. It's, it feels really horrible. This hurts. This is 15 diamonds. But this is a showing of how bad I am at protecting myself from withers, which is why I need to get better, which is why I'm doing this challenge. Like, the whole point of the Nuzlocke challenge was to keep me from dying, and I only died one time last season, which made me feel very bad. But this time around, um, it's important that I survive. And I don't know if you could hear that little pause in my speech. I suppressed a sneeze. I will not sneeze. It's not going to- I've never- I've coughed during videos, I've hiccuped, I've burped, um, I haven't expelled any other kinds of gases, but I've never sneezed 
during an episode of Let's Play with Clay, and I intend to keep it that way. I don't know why sneezes are such a bad thing, but they are. So there. And why don't I just use... Oh, I don't know, my fire aspect sword that has, you know, fire aspect, which means the meat cooks automatically. Everybody get out of the way, please. Everybody move. Thank you. Goodbye. I appreciate your meat and your leather. It means I can make books now, which is a very good thing. I like it when I can make books. It means that if I make books, I can make enchantments and I can enchant things and upgrade my weaponry because, hey, why not? And it's always good to have a stock by lag. No, it's always good to have a stock, because if you have a stock, then it means that you have plenty of enchantments for when you just can't repair your pickaxe anymore. Because after a while, it gets to be really expensive. So at some point, I will remember. Hey everybody, so I was in... well, I, I went mining to get the levels I needed, and then I went into the nether to try to farm wither skulls, and I was very happy about doing that, and then, you know, I realized that my game menu for Windows 10 wasn't actually recording. So, yeah. We're all out of levels now, which is really annoying, and we need to get more so that we can do enchanting, because I want to actually enchant things. So I think I'm gonna get work, you know, get to work on that. And there's some other things that I need to make too, like golden apples and make a chest for fighting the wither. And so yeah, and I guess that's what I'm going to do. So I will see you guys in a moment. Okay, so we have the fighting wither chest. Um, I've been officially reminded that I do not have any wither skulls yet because hey, why not? You know, why would we ever need those? Those aren't important at all. So, yeah. Um, episode 32, and we still don't have a Wither Skull, which, uh, you know... Everybody who's played this game can understand that feeling. So, yeah. If, if you're wondering where I'm going right now, it's just to breed cows. Because levels. And I need to repopulate the cow population. Populate, everybody! Populate! Okay, so, yeah. Moving on with life. Things are nice and... daylight again, which feels good. So, um, yeah. Upgrades to the sword. A lot of upgrades. I didn't actually know that you could put thorns on a sword, which is, um... good, I guess. So... Yeah, <laughs> this is an hour of mining and work and things to make things and to get things and yeah. Um, if I seem distracted at any point, it's just because my cat just opened my bedroom door right now and she's staring at me. But look what we can do! We can enchant and we can get things and it's gonna be great and I forgot my lappies because that makes sense, you know? I've only been enchanting in Minecraft for how long? And... Yeah, so, um... Let's see what we can get. It, It's still gonna... F I don't mind the lapis thing, it's just the whole... You get to see the enchantments, but... Okay. I'm fine with that. Because we have looting two on our sword, and we can make it looting three. I'm totally fine with that enchantment. That's amazing. And I wasn't expecting to ever get that first try, so, um... Okay. <laughs> that was good. So, let's do it. No! Why? Why is it too expensive? That shouldn't be too expensive. That's not fair. Maybe I switch them? No. Does it it's because of stupid thorns! Thorns one! Thorns shouldn't even be able to be put on a sword anyways because it's for armor. It's stupid. <sighs> so... Can... No? I can't even combine those. No, please, no. That's, that's still too expensive. That's really annoying. 
Minecraft broke the rules. I don't like this. So I want to turn the sword into looting 3, but in order to do that I have to go into creative mode, so I want you guys to let me know in the comments what I should do. Do I go into creative mode or not? So anyways, I will see you guys in the next episode. So thanks for watching, and see you next time.